to production of the <laughs> of the the ribbons. Hi, I'm Morgan Freeman and I'm going to talk to you about river pollution. This is a major global problem. As you can see, I'm standing next to the greatest river on earth, the Amazon River. This is the most complex river in the world and it's got the most water creatures. These creatures, lives are in danger because of human waste. Hi, I'm here to speak to you about pesticides and fertilizers. Do you know anything about them? Yes, my factory makes them all the time. Do you know what happens when the containers leak? No. They they go into rivers and pollute them. What about that? I think that's all right. It's not because the egg, that's killing um, nature and water animals. All of these companies are putting chemical waste into rivers. It's polluting the river water and it's harming animals. A couple of miles away, I saw children swimming in the rivers. Poison water can cause cancers and skin diseases. Guys, look! Look, there's a river! Let's jump into the water. It looks very clean. Don't jump in! Let's do it! river in, in Indonesia. Also, the river Citrum is the third largest and longest in Java. It has a very important role, life of the people who live in the West Java, as it supports the agriculture, water supply, fishery, industry, and lots more. When animals drink polluted water, they can get a disease. People can also get a disease by eating the infected animals. <coughs> Hi, I'm a scientist. And this water bottle is filled with 
the River Citrum polluted water. The River Citrum has been called the world's most polluted river. Around 5 million people live near the river. Thank you for listening. But I went swimming in the River Citrum last year. You are lucky. The River Citrum is the most polluted river in the world. Hello, I didn't see you there. And I forgot to tell you, the River Citrum is the most polluted river by humans cooking and washing. Now, the summary of the fact. This, this is our summary. summary. The River Citrum is the third largest and longest river in Indonesia. When animals drink polluted water, they can get a disease and die. The river citrum has been called the most polluted river in the world. The river citrum is polluted by humans washing and cooking. Bye. 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 Welcome to Woodlands na Nature. I'm looking forward to talking about rivers but first of all I want to talk about what I had for dinner last night. Cut, cut, cut. We've warned you about this before. You're fired. Keep the camera rolling. I want to talk what sauce I had with my dinner last night. Security. Hello and welcome back to Woodland Nature. First I'm going to talk about the sauce. The sauce is the start of a river. It normally starts at mountains and hills. Wait, she's taking my job! Next, I'm going to talk about the riverbed. The riverbed is the bottom of a river. The riverbank is the edges of a river. No! No, she's taking my job! You're fired! Thank you for listen, listening to Woodland Nature. is the second longest river in the United Kingdom but the longest river in England over to Harris. Boulders and logs make the pow power of the flowing river very dangerous even with a life jacket on. Workers have built more than 200 bridges on the River Thames which helps to connect more than 80 islands. Did you know over 100 mammals have been spotted in the River Thames? Boom! Ah! Help! Help! Ah! Help! 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 Get in my rescue boat! A rescue boat finally came in to save the boy. now. I'm Amy Sullivan here at Sky News with Mrs Sidhu complaining about the local river being polluted by a young boy. How do you feel about this? Very angry and upset and also he comes every single day which I really get angry. Also when I'm cook cooking I, I can hear splashes of the river. So then I come to the river and I see this boy throwing so many dirty things like cans and stones and lots of rocks. He, and, I, and I just said I'm going to call the police and then he just runs away and disappears somewhere. But no one knows where he's gone. This is Sky News sign and I'm Amy Sullivan signing out. Yo!
young boy, you're under arrest. No. Habitats is a place where plants and animals live. Wait, stop! Who wants to hear that boring stuff? Well, what have you got? Anyway, habitats provide provides good food and water. Lots of animals like swans and turtles live here. Animals like cockroaches are really important in a habitat. They eat the dead plants and recycle the nutrients back into the soil, which helps the plants to grow. Sadly, many people are causing habitats to disappear around the world. to do my tricks live on TV. Me too. Are you the presenter? Well, yes I am, and you two are in my show. Oh, sorry. So you can find lots of things in a living river. For example, birds like a kingfisher and a mallard. Also, it's time for a quiz. Now. Yes, yes now. now. Do habitats provide water? Yes. yes. Do rabbits live in very cold weather? No. Do are cockroaches really important in a habitat? Yes. Are there thousands of animals that live near rivers? Yes. Tonight we are going to talk about the River Thames and the Amazon River. The length of the River Thames is 346 kilometres long but 215 miles. However, the Amazon River is the world's second longest river at 6,400 kilometres, 4,000 miles long. This is the River Thames. The source is the River Head, which is one mile north of the village Camel. The River Thames is the only river in the UK that has tidal barriers. The River Thames is the longest river in England. Two thirds of London's drinking water comes from the River Thames. This is the end of the River Thames Bank. Over to Fahim and Nemia and the Amazon River. The River Amazon runs through South America. The Amazon River is also a home for a piranha fish. There are over there they are over three thousand species of fish that live in the Amazon River. The Amazon River is the longest river in the world. The second longest. It flows through Peru, Brazil, Venezuela, Ecuador, Bolivia. The Amazon River is the widest river in the world and is six miles wide. This is the end of the news. Anything because the water is too clear. 
Here I can go rocks, reeds, and rubbish underwater, and very, very, very many kinds of fish. What type of fish are you trying to catch? I'm trying to catch a nice big juicy roach, or maybe a carp would be nice. I'm late for tea. I better go. This, take this. It's something that I called earlier. Thank you. Bye. Did you know that the River Thames is a mile long and has been important trade route throughout its history? Did you, did you also know that Sir Joseph Basil get the London sewer system? But before they they put all the dump in the River Thames. Ugh, that's disgusting.
created by humans, throwing junk, rubbish and old things they, do, they don't need to use into the river. Is that true or is it false? False. false. True. 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 The answer is true. Yeah! Oh. River Amazon is home to the great white shark, making it dangerous to swim and for other species of animals to live in. True or false? What do you think is right? True. True. Well, True. TV? False. The answer is false. Yeah! <laughs> and now for a tiger. The two thousand of London's drinking water comes from the River Thames. Is that true or is it false? TV? True. True. False. The answer, the answer is true. Yeah! <laughs> there were four true facts. Hey, that's my job. Be right back after the break. Hi, this is the weather news report and I am here in Britain near the River Thames. I am here to say that it's very cold near the river. This is the Missouri River. It is very hot and wild. The grass is very wet and it hasn't quite yet dried yet. It is very hot. It is 34 degrees. Did you know the Missouri River was the biggest river in North America? We will be learning about about wildlife at the River Amazon. There are many animals in the river such as butterflies, dragonflies and red piranhas. Yeah. One of my explorers is trying to fish out a red piranha, which is one of the most deadliest fishes in the world, which can, which can bite off your whole thing. Ouch! Wow! This, this explorer must have got bitten really hardly by a red piranha. Hello, this is a Rivers of the World documentary. Breaking news, the Jammu Davi has over flooded, a terrible flood indeed. This has affected many people's lives and some people have even lost everything they own. Meanwhile, the river used to be as dry as a bone in a desert. As you have just heard, it's a terrible flood, even though River Tavi is just a tributary of River Channel. Now over to River Ganges in India as, as well. Hello, welcome to River Ganges. This river is in India and it is the longest river in India. Hello, this is River Ganges. It is very beautiful, but it kills many people's lives if they drink that water. River. It is, this river is in India. It is very holy because it has, if you bathe in it, all your bad deeds goes away. Hello, and I'm Maisha, and this is my model. So this is the source up on high on the mountains. These are the interlocking spurs sticking out of the river. They're a bit like tributaries. Here is a gorge where the river gets slightly deeper. And then after the gorge comes a waterfall, which falls down. The way it falls down is because it erodes the rock. Then they become plant. Here is a V-shaped valley, the fifth part of the river. The meanders are here. There are curves in the river. Now there's a river cliff. Fishermen can sit on the river cliff to fish. Over here is the Oxbow Lake, a meander cut off by the river. The floodplain is over here. It's a bit like a delta except slightly different. 
The ground here is really flat, so whenever the river overfloods, it floods all of this area. Finally, the estuary, the mouth of the river. Here is my whole model. Hello, welcome to River Mississippi. I'm Rashida, and this is Mississippi in North America. The River Mississippi flows through 10 following U.S. states. Louisiana, Mississippi, Arkansas, Tennessee, Kentucky, Missouri, Illinois, Iowa, Wisconsin, and Minnesota. Its length is 6,020 kilometers. Hello, today I'm Hello, today I'm going to tell you about the river seen in France. It flows through the city of Paris. Many famous artists have painted this river because it's very beautiful. We're on our amazing adventure to the Mississippi. The Mississippi is one of the third longest rivers in the world. The Mississippi is the most famous river in America. Hi, my name is Bobby and this is my partner Cameron. Hi, my name is Cameron and we're going to be talking about the history of the rivers. Did you know that most rivers start at mountains at, at all hills and they end at the sea? And did you know the uh, Amazon River is the deepest river and the Nile is the oldest? Wow! Hey, my name is Bria and today me and my buddy Nikita are going to be telling you about the prison of rivers. Nikita! Hi everybody, my name is Nikita and today I'm going to be telling you loads of outstanding facts about rivers. So first, did you know that rivers blend channels? The sides are called the bank and the bottom is called the bed. The boat's well, walking. Um, no, don't go too fast! Ah, we have you to go! Go! Welcome to our documentary about rivers. About the River Severn. To learn about the River Severn, we brought some people, some children and their teacher from Castleview School along to help us. The River Severn is in Wales and it's the longest river in Great Britain, measuring 354 kilometres in length and 3.5 kilometres wide and 50 foot deep. Miss. Where does the River Severn start and end? That's good question. That's a good question. The River Severn starts at the Cinnamon Hills and ends near Swansea. As well as fish, you'll find brown rats, which are very strong swimmers, and wild mink, the size of, which are the size of small cats. Wild mink love to eat fish and birds. What is a mink? A mink is a small mammal. Did you know that? Thank you, Castle View, for your amazing work and facts all about the River Severn. Good morning and welcome to BBC Rivers. Today we have some exciting news about two different rivers. First, we're going to talk about the River Nile. Today I'm going to be giving you a journey up the Nile south to North. The first famous landmark we're at is the Sud. The Sud is a swamp. In the wet season, the Sud floods up to 130,000 kilometres. The second famous landmark is where the Blue Nile and the White Nile meet. Astonishingly, you can see the two colours together for difference before you before they blend together. The, the last famous landmark is the Great Bend. Thank you. Did you know 10% of the world's known species live in the Amazon rainforest? Also, in 1960, the Amazon, popu the Amazon po population was around 2,000, but now the population has grown to around 300 million. That was very nice. Now over to... Uh, be quiet!
of Dumbo. Shh. Did you believe it? The first one to discover the Amazon River was Frankenstein. I mean, Frankesso Diorel. That was very nice mistake. Now I'm going to show you the journey of the river. Here we have two mountains that have the source of the river coming down. And then as you pass, you see the Oxbow Lake formed by erosion. And then the, there's meanders, then it ends with the mouse. mouse. This is my hotel and my name is Queen Patra. You've got anything you want. You've got a lovely view. You've got a hotel. You've got lots and lots and lots of hot towers. I live in the Nile and it will be so good if you come and have a nice holiday here and it would be perfect. You could come here for the summer, for your holiday or even for a honeymoon and be really romantic. This is my Atlantis Beauty Hotel. 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 And my number is 555 Nile. Come and visit me. We really thought it was lovely. Then, until we got our arms bitten off, ah! uh, we are totally getting a refund. Do you want to learn about the water cycle? I don't know anything about the water cycle. And you are in the right place. Evaporation is when the sun heats up the water in the rivers oceans or lakes and turns into vapour or steam. Condensation is when water and vapour um, change into liquid which forms clouds. Precipitation occurs when so much water has condensed that, it, that the air cannot hold it anymore. Hello? Hello? Who is it? This is Indiana Jones. Oh, hello Indiana Jones. Have you reached Egypt yet? Yes, I would like to talk to Mr. President, please. Okay, let me just give him the phone. Um, excuse me, Mr. President. Indiana please. Jones would like to give you, um, would like to talk to you. Thank you. Hello, Mr. Jones. I need you to get me the treasure, which is at the River Nile. Will you get, will you receive it for me? I'll give you five million pounds if you get it, if you receive it for me. You mean, can you dial up the, can you dial that up to ten million? Alright. Bye. 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 He came across a riddle. It said that it would have helped him find the treasure. <laughs> what has a mouth but never talks? What has a bed but never sleeps? What runs but never walks? Hello, do you know anything about the River Nile? Yes, I do. Do you want some facts? Yes, please! The River Nile flows through 10 countries. This is the longest river in the world. Its mouth is the Mediterranean Sea. Did you know the River Nile's name came from Greek word? It mean, Nile means V-shaped valley. The River Nile is a, approximately 6,670 kilometers long.